Hi, and welcome to Russell Cooks. Today, I'm really excited because I'm going to be cooking something called the chopped cheese sandwich. Now, this is found throughout New York City, Queens, Brooklyn, um, the Bronx, anywhere there's a bodega, you can find a chopped cheese sandwich. Now, there are tons of meat and cheese sandwiches throughout the U.S. and world. What sets these apart are the ingredients, the seasoning, and then classic American cheese. So to start, you take some sub rolls, or if you're from New York, some hero rolls, and you put a little spread of a mayo ketchup combination. I like a three to one ratio of mayo to ketchup. And then you cook up some ground beef, some onions, and you use some Goya adobo seasoning and some seasoning salt, something like Lowry's. Now you can make your own paprika, onion, garlic powder, um, Salt, make sure all those are in there. Maybe a little bit of turmeric, you know, spice things up a bit. Sprinkle it on, you cook it. You put it on your prepared heroes or subs, and then you layer them with American cheese. Not cheddar, American cheese. Pop it in your oven just until the cheese melts, and then you shingle on some tomatoes and shredded lettuce. Lastly, you roll the whole thing up. Parchment's preferred, but you can also use tin foil. I personally prefer tin foil. Um, it also heats up great. All right, so now we know what we're doing. Let's get cooking. Okay, to get started, you need one pound of ground beef, one onion chopped fine, one tomato sliced thin, three quarters of a teaspoon of Goya adobo seasoning, one and a quarter teaspoon of seasoning salt, two hero rolls, one cup shredded lettuce, eight slices of American cheese, six tablespoons of mayo, two tablespoons of ketchup. There's the cut onion sliced tomato, hero rolls, Goya, and Lurries, and the cheese. First, I'm going to turn my oven on and preheat it to 400 degrees. This is just to melt the cheese. Next, I'm going to rub my mayo ketchup mixture and spread it on my sub rolls that I've halved and sliced horizontally. Now I'm going to preheat my griddle. You can also do this in a 12 inch skillet, nonstick or regular. I am setting my griddle to medium high heat. Now let's cook. Start putting the beef on, I'm going to chop it up, and I'm going to sprinkle it with my onion, followed by my Goya adobo seasoning, and my seasoning salt. Now, I'm going to scoop the meat and put it in my hero rolls. Careful not to get hot grease on your hands. Then I'm going to layer the American cheese on top. Now, Let's get ready to wrap things up. First, I'm going to shingle some tomato and then some shredded lettuce and roll it all up very tight and set it aside. For an alternative, if you don't like tomatoes, you can always use some thinly sliced banana peppers. They're quite delicious and add a briny, spicy punch.
Now it's time to take a bite. Let's dig in. Thanks so much for joining for another clip and video from Russell Cooks. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe, and you can follow me on Twitch at twitch.tv slash Russell Cooks. Thanks again, and I'll see you next time. Keep cooking.